G'day everybody and welcome to another YouTube video review. Here we are looking at the Iron Man Super Tech Heroes construction toy by Mega Blocks, uh, consisting of 39 pieces and for ages 6 and up. Uh, you would have previously seen my Wolverine uh, video that I did on this one. If you haven't, go check it out. Uh, so there's a Wolverine figure as well. So as you can see here, we have the Iron Man and the Iron Man box that he came in. So you can put him in a different pose. I'll spin him around there so you can have a look. There's Iron Man standing there nice and tall, again giving you some indication that he has an LED in his head and if you push the button on the back his eyes will light a nice blue. And a little different to the Wolverine figure, Iron Man comes with a little weapon this time, shoots a projectile from a sort of missile launcher that attaches to his arm. Then Megablox has also put down some more information on some vehicles that you can put together. There's a Spider-Man and a Venom uh, vehicle that you can buy through the set and put together as well. So I'll move over to the figure now so you can have a look. Uh, I didn't mention this in the Wolverine one, but the figure stands roughly around about 12 inches tall. Fully poseable, uh, all his wrists, ankles, knees, elbows, uh, torso, everything, head is all fully movable so you can rotate things around and put them into different positions. So I've got him in a bit of a stance there. You can see, we'll move down to his feet to give you a bit of a look up the legs. Moving into the torso, so he's got a nice blue ball that you just insert into the front there. There's his head, or his mask. There's the rocket launcher, the projectile missile that we were talking about. I'll spin him around there so you can have a look at the back. Again, it's um, really an interesting uh, construction. Um, especially seeing how, like, you know, we've got the Transformer movies coming out. And it just sort of it gives you the impression that this is what Iron Man might look like if he was a Transformer. On the back here is the button that we push to make his eyes light up, so I'll spin him around so you can see that. Uh, unfortunately, he's light. the eyes don't stay on, but you've got to keep pushing the button, which is a little bit disappointing, because it'd be nice to have his eyes light up every now and then. The projectile, like most toy projectiles, you just push the button at the back here, and the missile fires, and it actually goes quite a good distance, so whatever the spring is they put in there, um, <laughs> it's wound up pretty tight. So here's the construction booklet, just to give you a quick overview like I did for Wolverine. You can see there, there's the pieces that he comes with, 39 in all. And then it's just a case of working through the book to put him together. Same deal with Iron Man as if was with Wolverine. You just clip the sections together. You push the blue thing through his chest to give him that blue look. Put the panels on the back and then you're left with a fully poseable figure. So again for $15, half price at the Target toy sale, he uh, he really was a bargain. We didn't actually get the Spider-Man version, which I mentioned in the Wolverine review because Spider-Man wasn't available, but we'll keep our eyes out for that as well. So I'll bring in Wolverine now so you can see the two of them together. And so if you're looking for uh, a toy for a birthday gift, or you're a bit of a fan of Wolverine or Iron Man, uh, or even looking at something to put away for Christmas to, uh, to get away for the kids later, I really recommend these. Because uh, for a $15 Sort of construction toy, it's cheaper than Lego and the kids will probably get a great buzz out of it. Thanks for watching, keep subscribing and cheers.